maintain them. The first step in solving this problem of oily effluent is to know how much oil is present in your effluent. Now this can be done by having proper water monitoring systems in place which not, will not only help you meet the stringent pollution control board norms but also help you reduce the cost of water treatment. Nowadays because of the stringent norms laid down by the state pollution control boards the authorities expect you to keep extensive records of all the waste that goes into the effluent and how is your effluent treatment plant working. And these water monitoring systems, especially if they have any oil sensors or sensors which can detect the amount of oil present in your effluent, will help you create a better credibility in their eyes, which will help you stay ahead of various issues before they become critical. The best solution to deal with the free floating oil from the ETPs is to have an effective skimmer. Now I know that there exists a number of different varieties of skimmers to choose from. Hence my recommendation is to use a tube skimmer because a tube skimmer can have an adjustable length of endless tube which can rotate along the entire surface of your ETP tank and collect oil from various locations or various corners of the tank. And hence the chances of oil causing any problems in the effluent reduce considerably because the tube skimmer tends to remove the oil faster than the rate of oil addition. Some other advantages of using a, a tube skimmer are that they are not dependent or it does not matter to the tube which oil is removing. It can be crude oil, it can be lubricating oil, it can be hydraulic oil, it can be viscous or diesel oil, any kinds of oil. As long as it sticks to the tube, it will be removed. Now the beauty of this tube is that it is oleophilic, that is it attracts the oil. Now if you have seen any oil floating on top of tank, generally it is not in particles, it is in the form of chains. So if you can imagine that if you pull one end of the chain, the other end of the chain also tends to come towards it. So tube skimmer in that aspect can remove much more amount of oil than its design capability. Moreover, it can remove the oil continuously and automatically. Nobody needs to attend to it. It usually generally has only a motor and uh, unless and until the motor is working, the tube skimmer will work. Now the tube skimmers that we make, we use ceramic parts because the oil which is attracted to the tube needs to be scraped off. Now the advantage of ceramic parts for scraping is that they don't wear out as easily as plastics. And using metallic parts is not suggested because that might cause breakage in the tubes used. 